All right, so hey, what's up? What's going on to all my Capricorns? So um, let's get into it. So uh, let me move this back some. All right. Okay, so for my Capricorns, you have the Five of Pentacles, the Page of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles, um, the Strength, the King of Cups, the King of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups, the Star. You have the Six of Wands. Last but not least, you have the Queen of Pentacles. So what I'm seeing here for uh, you Capricorns. Okay, so. Okay, so you Capricorns have stopped trying to look so much when it comes to uh, relationships. Um, a lot of you Capricorns don't necessarily put in you won't put in too much effort anymore when it comes to finding relationships because i see that you capricorns starting to have the perception that um you're doing too much without any kind of uh compensation right like you're not actually getting uh the people that you would particularly want or the type of people that you would particularly want and I think that a lot of you Capricorns are kind of done and walking away from that, right? Um, the Page of Pentacles and the Ten of Pentacles represents, however, uh, you know, you, you will continue to try to get to know people, but um, it's more so the Ten of Pentacles. You will only try to get to know people, but sparingly right it's more it'll it'll be more sparing in a sense that you're going to get to know people but um fewer times right um i'm seeing i'm i'm just seeing how a lot of you uh capricorns was on a, was on a time frame where a lot of you capricorns may have been trying to get to know a lot of different people um not necessarily putting yourselves out there like that, but put, you know, as as like a like a like a uh, in that sense, but more so putting yourselves out there in the way where you're actually trying to get to know people. And I just I'm just seeing how you know people have kind of ran amok with um, your patience. So as a result of this, I'm just, I'm just seeing how a lot of you Capricorns are like, yeah, I'm done you know, and, um, you know, you, you're going to still continue to try to get to know people, but I'm just saying, I'm just seeing how, and saying how, um, I'm just seeing how a lot of you Capricorns are just going to be like, if I get the person good, if I don't, it is what it is. While at the same time, still, uh, maintaining that eye, right. Maintaining that, um, the eyes and ears to where if you understand that you get someone that is, uh, valuable like that where they do have some sort of worth to them then you will actually uh do with them like you do with everyone else and try to take them seriously though you know i should say the ones that come off right the ones that should be taken seriously right because not everybody is going to uh, uh appear to be taken seriously you will have some people who are, are mess ups so the thing is is that the strength, right? The strength is about now how um, this, in this particular reading, right? This this is about how uh, you, you need to be careful, you know, doing it a little bit too sparingly, right? Getting to know people because soon before you know it, years can end up passing by, right? Uh, years can end up passing by in a sense of um, if you don't watch out, right? If you don't watch out, uh, a whole year can pass by, two years can pass by where you're not necessarily really getting to know anybody. So, uh, because you're too busy um, staying to yourself. So the thing is that the King of Cups is about how, so you need to put yourself out there. Um, you need to put yourself out there the same way that you have been putting yourself out there. You just need to develop that, that you, you need to develop that, that, uh, or you, I should say, you need to train yourself as to how to spot 
the 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 people who actually have value from the people who don't okay um you know and if you like to know how then contact me uh to get a reading kareem spearworks at yahoo.com or you can go directly to my website the link to that is in the description box below but um as well as in the comment section below and my book but um so the king of pentacles represents how this is a situation for you where the king of pentacles now is so you know you're concentrating on on your cash right your business but also the king of pentacles is also a card that you need to concentrate on your emotional state as well because this is an intense time for you where this is this is you kind of putting yourself right back into your work kind of like how some people eat through their pain right when they when they are under stress they eat yeah well it's the same situation right for comfort it's the same situation for you capricorns you capricorns may end up putting yourselves into your work right and kind of hiding behind your work because you because yes you like work of course but also because of your own emotional state so the king of pentacles is not just a card based upon getting money the king of pentacles is a card based upon intense uh situations and how it is that you need to um get yourself into uh an emotional state where you're able to deal with what exactly is going on with you so the ace of cups and the uh the star card are about um as you're doing this, you will come to find out that a lot of people will try to uh, communicate with you. Um, and more specifically, a lot of people whom you didn't necessarily anticipate, or you, I should say, you didn't expect anyone to really say what's up to you at all. Um, at all. You didn't expect that at all. Um, what it is that you did expect. Let me open this one more. What it is that you did expect is you expected you expected um, to just be left alone. And now you have a situation where, you know, a lot more people are, are trying to say what's up without you even trying. And that's and that's one of the secrets, right? When you're actually doing the work and you're doing it uh, sincerely, but you're not... Um, too attached to it that's when it is that you get an answer right so the thing is that the six of wands and the uh queen of pentacles are about the next step for you capricorns to take which the next step for you is to ultimately keep doing the emotional work right something that we all need to do right without exception because the emotional that with the lack of emotional work is what causes a lot of us to make terrible decisions right along with just being imperfect right that you can you know what i'm saying but that you can never fix but the queen of pentacles represents um and and like i said before you know a lot of people are going to um communicate with you in that sense where they will try to look out for you you know ask about you and stuff like this so you know um what was i gonna say so uh, 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 let's clarify the King of Pentacles. Matter of fact, you know what? Let's let's actually clarify a more vague card so that y'all can get some better understanding. Let's clarify the Star card. Let's, let's clarify that. You know what I'm saying? So, um, so you have the, uh, four of pentacles, you have the six of cups and last but not least, you have the, uh, three of wands. So, um, okay. So six of cups, someone is obviously coming back. So, uh, some of these people will be people that is coming back. Obviously we're still going through a mercury retrograde for the ones who did not know. A mercury retrograde means that expect to be communicate, uh, to expect to get a contact from your uh, exes, the people whom you stopped talking to. Uh, 
as well as you will see some new faces though but also your exes are going to try to communicate with you too the four of pentacles and the three of wands is you just need to kind of be a, the judge right you need to sit back and, and and kind of um observe who comes through while at the same time continuing to do your own emotional work right the king of pentacles is a uh, capricorn and taurus card put together right so you do come up in this reading not necessarily in a major arcana but you do show up in this reading anyway and um and then the three of wands represents just don't necessarily um uh be to be uh, too detached excuse me don't be too attached to anyone right now because remember you're still supposed to be going through that emotional work right because it's that's the the proof of it actually working it's the fact that you you are doing that emotional work where you are uh figuring out your own emotional baggage and at the same time you're getting the results People are coming to you, right? Old people, new people are coming to you. And you you kind of have your own pick now. Now, I'm not necessarily saying that those people are going to be amazing standout picks. I never said that. But what I am saying is, is that you are starting to see results. Now, the next step is for you, is for you to continue to do that emotional work as well as pick the right people for you that'll actually work now let's continue um let's clarify the uh the queen of pentacles all right so um so we have the uh queen of cups the ten of wands okay and the ace of pentacles to clarify the queen of uh pentacles so the queen of um the queen of cups is make sure that these people actually have some sort of compassion with you or compassionate to you right they have some sort of empathy with you as well as they can take right the queen of pentacles as well as they're able to take care of themselves because you don't necessarily want to be with someone who is incapable of doing either they need to do both otherwise it's a no-go if they can't take care of themselves but they are empathetic and they and you know they don't want to take care of themselves and or they can't and they're not trying then it means that they don't it it, it they lack internal value because they're lazy if they lack empathy but they have money then that's that's terrible too cuz it means that that's the way that they're going to treat you in the relationship because they're going to be too paranoid thinking that all thinking that you want money even though that's not necessarily what you capricorns may want so the 10 of uh the 10 of uh wands and the ace of uh pentacles represents this being a situation for you where this is about how you need to understand that um and yeah just keep it pushing you know meet some people see if they're the people for you see if they are responsible okay uh and if they're not leave them alone, you know, but that's it. Uh, comment, like, subscribe. Peace.